Hi there everyone, um, I'm back today with uh, with another special feature and um, I've decided to go with Life on the Streets, um, the Norfolk system and that's going to be a, uh, a systematic approach to growing up in Norfolk and surviving surviving the, uh, the county that I grew up in. Um, so for any of you that don't know it, it's uh, on the east side of, uh, of England where gang warfare is rife and um and whenever you're just walking around it seems like there's beef waiting for you at every corner um i mean that's probably because of all the farms and cows but um but it's a lot to deal with at the time um so this is my system to growing up in the hood um n is never hang around for too long on the street after you've been food shopping and this is because drive-by tractor ins are up 315 percent since 2001 um now a drive-by tractor in is when a farmer will just be chugging along the road and they'll spot you have a food bag from somewhere like asda or um, tesco's and they will simply shout at you in a mocking tone and say things like uh like, oh, Nancy boy, you can't fucking even grow your own produce, can you? Um, um, for, for who couldn't understand that, it was a uh, Nancy boy, you can't even grow your own produce, can you? Um, now that can that can really cut to the core, um, especially in a in a rural place like that. Um, so run home after shopping and uh, don't be another statistic. Um, <clears throat> oh is only pay attention to geography and French at school. Now, geography will help you with your knowledge of fields um, because let's face it, you're gonna be a farmer. Uh, you're gonna sell tomatoes and uh, and carrots on, on the street corner. Um, and it makes me fucking sick, but it's a vicious circle that we're in. Um, <clears throat> but French is for, is for the frogs if they decide to invade from France um, because they're just over the road, well, over the sea. And uh, we're the first point of entry, so we can tell them what we think if they try and do it. Um, and my favourite is probably "Je suis kill you," "Je suis kill you," and they all know you're fucking serious, all right. Um, now R is um, rarely leave the county. People in the rest of the world they don't understand us. Uh, they belittle us and they call us backwards and inbreds. Um, but what I would say to that is that the joke is on you. Um, at least if you're inbred, there's usually a guaranteed lay in the house. Um, and my one-eyed child is uh, is beautiful and unique. So fuck you. Um, F is feed the pigs. Now, there's an abundance of pig farms in Norfolk, so if you ever get caught up in a dodgy dealing with, uh, with a greengrocer um, and you have to make him disappear, then the pigs can take care of that for you. Uh, I think they only leave the teeth. Um, o is only support Norwich City, uh, the most successful and biggest supported club in East Anglia. Uh, Ipswich is a dirty word and a place full of cunts, basically. Um, and L is... Uh, Leave Great Yarmouth well alone. It's a town that has chavs and devil women in it. Uh, you could walk into Yarmouth Town Centre and get a girl pregnant simply from having unprotected sex with her underneath the pier. It's, a, it's an awful, awful place. Um, and um, K is knock before you come in. Uh, anybody ever remember a guy called Tony Martin? A uh, guy... Guys tried to burgle him, uh, so he shot him with a shotgun because they were on his land and they tried to get into his house. So um, up the Tony Martin, he shoots burglars and so do we. Fucking knock before you come in. Um, so that was my that was my guide to to surviving surviving the hood. That is Norfolk, and um, I hope you enjoyed it.